Hi everyone and welcome back to some more Battle Brothers. So, let's continue where we left off. And before we move on, let's sell a few things, shall we? We can sell the signet ring, I think. Yeah, the price is pretty good, just above its value. And we'll get rid of the broken shield. And we can probably sell some of this junk. Yeah, we need better armor at this point. And maybe a shield or two. I'll keep the helms though, these are actually pretty good. Alright, and we also need some tools, medical supplies, the prices are pretty good, so we can restock in here, and some ammunition. Okay, and now we can move on. So, let's check the other towns, there's no contract in here, so we'll check the two towns to the south. And see what's going on there. There is a contract in here. And also disappearing villagers, alright. So what's this all about? Three hundred thirty crowns. Hunt down or terrorizes camp waiter. Okay, fine. I think that means we need to patrol around the city. I think so, yeah. Oh, dire wolves! Okay, I'm not sure if we can handle those. Because they are really tough. They can kill you very, very easily. Yeah, I'm not sure if we can handle this. We can certainly try, but it's going to be rough. I can already tell you that. Yep, they are coming. I know they have low resolve, so if we can manage to kill one, that might be enough to scare the rest. So let's maybe try that. We'll try to kill one. It will come down to luck, because that's basically what it is. What's our chance to hit here? Well, too low. Unless we move. Let's move to some high ground. And the pitchfork. 65%. Okay, nice. If we can kill one quickly, this might just be enough. I guess we'll find out. Let's see. We'll try something like this. And spear wall. So we need to hit with the 200, 48%. Nice, it's not quite dead yet. Now it's dead, awesome. Okay, one down. Three more to go. Three might not seem like much, but these are really tough. They can kill you very, very easily. Yep, as you can see, that's a ton of damage. We are probably going to lose one brother here. Unless we can manage to kill one more very quickly. Oh great, now he's in range of our crossbowmen. That's not so good. Need to do something about that. I can't really move. Let's move him to the end of the queue. And let's see. Try to knock back. Nice. That worked. Just to save our two-handed guy. Okay, nice shot. I can only move one tile and still attack. There. The armor is gone. Not that they have a lot of armor to begin with. Now, we could try to knock back this one, but it's going to attack regardless. I can't really prevent that from happening, and I can't really move out of here anyway. Well, not too bad so far, but I don't think we'll kill one on this turn. That seems unlikely. We will probably blows Arn the Butcher. Unless he gets lucky and survives, but... It's going to be rough. Okay, not bad. Come on, can we kill one? Almost. But not quite. Well, I can't really move. I can try, but chances are I will just take damage if I try. So that's just not a good idea at all. Moment of truth. Is he going to survive or not? 
He actually survived. Nice. Okay, we didn't lose anyone yet. Let's see if we can do this. He's still in trouble, don't get me wrong. But this might just be doable. Great, we missed. Come on, people. Oh, great, I killed my own guy. Well, that's not necessarily what I intended, but... I pretty much assumed that guy is going to die regardless. Come on. There, we killed another one. I think we'll kill them. I honestly didn't expect to, because dire wolves are really rough. Hold on, that wasn't necessarily a good idea. <laughs> We almost won. Come on. Kill it. At least one of them before our turn is over. Yeah, they do so much damage, holy crap. It's almost dead. It has like one health left. Slightly annoying, but all right. There, it's down. Nice. One more. We actually won. Shame we lost one guy, but oh well. Worth 200, nice. All right, let's go back for a reward. Did we get any level ups? Yes, we did. Okay, let's have a look. So, Gustav. Only plus one for melee skill, that's bad. Okay, then. Yeah, these are some really bad level ups. Improve his resolve. I suppose I'll pick up the plus one. Also, he needs better armor. And non-broken armor. That will do. And the perk. Student. So next. Next up is Nils. So. Melee skill, melee defense. And some fatigue. And student. Okay, next. Godheart. Melee skill, obviously. Maybe some resolve. And melee defense. And student again. Alright, looks good. Let's swap some of the gear. Yep, better helms. Especially on the front line, guys. Here you go. We'll have to repair some of it, but that's okay. And I think someone was using a weaker shield. Yes, this guy. Swap it for a better one. And I think that's it, basically. Yeah, that's pretty much it. One more weapon. Which one would that be? I wouldn't mind another spear, but we don't have one at the moment. We don't have a sword either. The flail isn't terrible, but it doesn't have any bonuses to hit. And this guy has very low melee skill. He's kind of useless, to be honest. He's like a backup of backup. More or less. Yeah, right now I prefer weapons with bonus chance to hit. Except none of these actually have any. I'll just keep him in reserve for now. Alright, so let's go back and get our gold. No more disappearing villagers. And we'll go check out the next town. Oh, 
Also, maybe we should use something else instead of the bow. I'm considering it, but we'll see. What's going on here? Raided and terrified villagers. Right. 240. 320, we accept. Sounds like we'll have to fight some undead. Oh, on the other side. And we have to go all the way around, seriously. Okay, that was so not worth it. But fine. I suppose we'll go. Oh no, we can take a shortcut. But before we do that, I think we need more tools. What's the price in here? Yeah, 327. That's way too much. I guess it will have to wait. But we are going to run out of tools by the time this expedition is over. Yep, seven, six. Five, and we still have some broken gear. Or do we? 84%. Okay, only one helmet. I can live with that. So, how bad is it? We can see what we'll be fighting. I think I have a pretty good idea what we'll be fighting. <laughs> Yep, these things again. Alright, at least these are easier than dire wolves. Dire wolves are just nasty. I hope we won't have to fight them again anytime soon. Because I'm not looking forward to that. We'll just wait for them over here. That seems like the best idea. Come on, don't be shy. Spear wall. Bring it on. There are quite a few though. This might be a tough fight. We'll find out. Fortunately, they don't have a whole lot of health. But they do have more once they get stronger. Yeah, that one almost killed itself. Looking good so far. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Come on, people. Kill at least one or two. No, we miss with both 200s. Not great. That was a pretty bad turn right there. Can we kill at least one? No, I guess not. I don't think so. <laughs> Nope, we didn't kill even a single one. Well, on the bright side, at least they won't eat the corpses. Or whatever they do with them. Because there are none at the moment. Yeah, one guy is almost dead already. That's Niels. We just need better armor. Gear is just as important as experience on your brothers. Sometimes more important. There, one down. Okay. Let's see if we can kill at least a few on this turn. Nice. This one is almost dead as well. Now, I can't really move unless we kill both. Nope. 41%. Yeah, we missed. Come on, people. Seriously, missed twice in a row? There, another one down. Let's kill one more. There. Okay, good. Can we get one more? Nice. Now, let's try to protect our two-handed guy. I'm not sure if we actually can. But I suppose we can try. It's just fairly unlikely. Well, I can't really move him safely, because he might just die while trying to move. Oh, the enemy retreats. 
yeah, it's over. I don't want to lose anyone. Just let them run. We got a level up. We got three level ups. And some loot. I'll take that. Thanks. That wasn't too bad. I'm satisfied with that engagement. Let's check the level ups. Level 3 on Adelbert. So, melee skill. Some more fatigue. And melee defense, plus 3. Good enough. And the perk. So, let's grab crippling strikes. I think I'll grab crippling strikes on all our melee. But we'll see about that. Next up, Sigmar. Let's see. Melee skill, melee defense, and maybe some health. And finally, Torleaf. He's ranged, right. So, ranged skill. Ranged defense. And some fatigue. And a perk. So, what can he pick up? Pathfinder isn't too bad. I'll have to think about this one. Bullseye, no. Quick hands isn't too bad. Okay, I'll have to think about my ranged. What exactly to pick up on them. I'll decide later. I mean, Crippling Strikes is still decent on them, I suppose. So we could always grab that. Fast Adaptation. Actually, that's not a bad idea because his skill is so low. Let's grab Fast Adaptation. And go back for a reward. We will have to buy some tools and supplies now. But we need to find a better price. Below 250 gold, basically. Anything above 250 is just way too much. Unless we get really desperate. But we are already down to zero. There are several towns in the area. Surely one of them will give us a decent price. Let's find out. Oh yeah, we have to wait. Alright, no problem. I guess we'll wait. We can actually camp, so how about we do that? Let's check now. Do we need food? Yeah, kind of. We do, actually. Anyway, tools and supplies. They don't have any! Yeah, they actually have none. Alright. Fine, I suppose. Get rid of this junk. Thirty-four. That doesn't seem like a very good price, considering it's worth two hundred. Alright, let's check the next town. We need some tools and supplies. I'll pay anything below 300 at this point. 328. See, that's just too much. I'm not that desperate. Do we have any broken gear right now? Let's see. As in, actually equipped. Yeah, armor. Mostly armor. I don't want to risk doing a contract with broken gear. Let's just find some cheaper tools and supplies. Hopefully Dunkental will have some. And we also have to buy food. High spirits. Okay, people are eager to do business with us. Let's see. 213. Good enough. I'll take that. 36 gold. I don't think we'll get a much better price for wolf pelts. Doesn't look like it. And we kind of need gold. Alright, let's just sell all this stuff. We need the money. And the bow. Now. We still need the food. So let's have a look. 
What's the cheapest food in here? 102. Grain is the cheapest. It will spoil in 7 days, but 7 days is quite a lot. I'll buy that. And I think we're fine. We got 888. Do we want to hire anyone? We probably should. Poacher. No. Killer on the run. I don't want a killer on the run. I'm pretty sure there's at least one bad event associated with killer on the run background. Any weapons or armor? I'm just checking. 80 armor, that is pretty nice, but a bit expensive. We do have a pitchfork in here. I think I'll grab one. Pole arms are quite nice. Okay, let's grab the pitchfork and I think we'll equip it right away. Actually, on this guy. His melee skill is kind of low, but oh well. It does have plus 10% chance to hit. So hopefully he will hit something. And get some level ups that way. Anyway, I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next episode. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.